For the past 20 years, Janice Lokelani Keihana Iku Kawakahi Hulihe e Kahauna Ele has had to carry two IDs. The county has never accommodated my name on my driver's license. Instead, it drops the 36th letter of her last name and doesn't print her first or middle name. So she also carries a state ID, which in the past included her full name. The governor's office went back to the computer department and they found a way to put our name on our state ID. But when Loki's state ID expired in May, her new ID came back just like her driver's license. She says it's created a number of problems, from not being able to travel to being questioned by police during a traffic stop. Uh, he looked at it and he goes, well, where's your first name? And I said, don't blame me. This is your department. This is the county. Loki says she has been told by the county to take her maiden name or even shorten her last name. But that would mean taking away the one thing she still has from her husband who passed away. And I went, oh, how disrespectful of the Hawaiian people. Loki reached out to KHON2's action line to find out if anything can be done. We pressed the Department of Transportation for answers. We have been made aware of that issue and I know right now they are working to um, to extend that limit to, I believe, 40 characters so that issue can be resolved. Which comes as a relief to Loke. I really, really appreciate any attention to this issue because it's not only for me, it's for those who come after me who also are going to be dealing with this in the future. Kanoi Gibson, KHON2 News.